Hi guys, it's Inamka4 here and we're going to be taking a look at the Waka Waka Solar Powered Power Pack. Now initially come across this product while looking at different ways in which to power smartphones and tablets while out and about and don't have access to constant electricity. Now in the West we take electricity for granted, certainly in the UK I can't even remember the last time that I didn't have electricity at home. But in developing countries as well as areas where natural disasters occur you can't always have access to 24-7 electricity. That's where I come across Waka Waka Power. Waka Waka do another variation of this particular product which is a solar powered light but this Waka Waka power unit is also a solar powered light as well as a charging unit to power smartphones and tablets. Now I got this from getwakawaka.com links will be in the description if you're after one as well. Pick this up for 69 euros which works out to be just under 75 pounds here in the UK and you're going to think that's pretty steep for what it is but their business model is for every one that you purchase they give another one away to a person in a developing country that can benefit from it. Let's get this open see what we get for our money and if you could just go through if I could have got any bigger scissors that would have been amazing that was some tough packaging so let's see if we can bend this open see what we get out of it so you got the packaging there the actual waka waka power pack itself here we'll just put that down and there should be a manual somewhere in here yeah there we go so we'll just get that out as well and we'll just leave the the packaging there. Let's take a quick look at the manual here, see what it looks like. Oh, I think it looks interesting. We've got a picture of the sun on the one side, which it harnesses the power from. you got a little bit about the company there and how it helps children in developing countries get light that otherwise wouldn't normally have access to it, what you can and can't do with it. Uh, you've got an SOS light there if you hold the button down for two seconds, as it says. And as it mentions there, you can charge it via the sun and it takes eight hours to get fully charged on the sun's power. You can also charge it in via mains lead as it says there if you want to just give it a bit of a kickstart. It takes four hours off a mains lead to be connected in via the micro USB cable so that's power going in obviously and you can obviously use uh, bottles, hang it off uh, some string off a ceiling or use a stand with it there. Now this is interesting the light settings here Two clicks of the power button gives you 20 hours of bright light on a full charge. Three clicks of the button gives you 40 hours of light. Four clicks of the button in energy saver mode gives you over 200 hours of bright light on full charge, which is absolutely amazing if you're in a developing country or you don't have access to any electricity at all just for some light. Carry on going down here, you've got some connectivity options there to obviously charge your phone or a, a tablet via the out USB 2.0 port there as you can see and some of the indicators listed there just stating if it's charging you got a red LED slow charge, fast charge it blinks three times faster, obviously battery status is full charge four green LEDs there and you've got a bit about the company there. As I say, links will be in the description to get wackawacka.com if you're interested in the company and the product. And here, the Wacka Wacka power charger itself up close and personal. So a big, chunky, powerful battery there. Almost blinding, get that turned down. Two LED, very powerful lights there. Obviously, the Wacka Wacka branding. And as I say, this is the power pack, not just the solar light itself. Very big, chunky silicone button. And if you have a quick look around the device before I open up the stand, You've got the red charging LED there. You just saw it blink, so it's charging very, very slowly indeed because it's not blinking very fast. You've got two holes there. Obviously, you can put the string through and kind of tie it to a ceiling while using the stand as well. You've got the four green LEDs to indicate how charged this device is via its internal 2200 milliamp hour battery. And if I just open this up, it unveils the micro USB port which you can plug into a wall socket to charge it up even faster and along this side you've got a USB 2.0 port which you can plug your devices into and here's the LED next to it just to give you an indication on whether or not it's actually powering your smartphone or tablet. Once your device is connected and charging you'll see a small blue LED next to the USB 2.0 port just indicating that power is flowing to your handset. Once the internal 2200 milliamp hour battery is fully charged it only takes two hours to fully charge your smartphone but if you're using a smartphone which is a bigger battery than the internal 2200 milliamp hour battery of the Waka Waka Power Pack for example like in the Samsung Galaxy S4 which is a 2600 milliamp hour battery 
all the Wacka Wacka Power Pack can do is top it off. But certainly this can be a lifeline if you're using something like the HTC One, which doesn't have a removable battery, so you have to power the internal battery contained within it. Providing a wider area of light can also be achieved easily while using a stand on a desk or on a bottle top, or using some string and just hanging it up. A simple press of the power button will illuminate the green battery status LEDs, and further down, you'll see the red solar charging LEDs blinking when charging is taking place via the sun. And that was a look at the Wacka Wacka Power Pack. I do like this product a lot, specifically the way it's designed and the colours that they've used, and you can feel good in your heart once you've purchased it that you're helping out children in developing countries have access to power and light while they're off the grid as ever any comments or questions you guys have got hit them up in the comment section down below there give us a thumbs up if you like this video and like what you saw and if you haven't already done so hit subscribe it's also down there as well doesn't cost you a penny and you can also check out some of our forthcoming videos thanks for watching have a wicked day and we'll see you next time